The gathering held at State House brought together all directorates resorting under the office of the president, especially those from the National Central Intelligence Services, National Planning Commission, and the Auditor General, amongst others. President Hifike Punya Pohamba arrived at the ceremony accompanied by First Lady Penhilpi for Pohamba. He was followed by President-elect Dr. Hage Gaingop and heads of various directorates in the president's office. The head of state started by commending all officials for the support given to him and his wife during his 10 years of serving the nation from the highest office in the land, the State House. I trust that you are re and energized to tackle the challenges of the new year. For those who did not go on leave due to the call of the national duty, I commend you for your continued service to our country and its people. President Pohamba informed the officials that his time to serve in this capacity will soon come to an end as he will go rest at his home village of Okanjengedi. He stressed that he is ready to hand over power to Dr. Gengop come the 21st of March and appealed to the employees to give their support to Dr. Gengop in order to take Namibia to greater heights, progress and development. The head of state, who appears to be delighted with leaving the office, called on the nation to join hands to mark the silver jubilee of Namibia's 25-year celebration of unity, peace and social development. Staff members of his office then presented President Pohamba with a gift containing a portrait of the state house, which he welcomed.